hey everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video i am going to show you how to create a memorizing colorful spiral animation using python's turtle graphics this project that we are going to do is beginner friendly and does not require any special libraries so guys by the end of this video you will know how to generate colorful animations with just a few lines of code so let's dive in so first we are going to import the turtle from turtle import star so uh, basically we just started by implementing everything from the turtle module the turtle library is a built-in graphics library in python and it's great for creating graphics and animations like this one we are creating all right after uh, importing this module we are going to import colorsys so uh, this colorsys module allow us to work with colors in the hsv color space so which which is practically useful for creating smooth color transitions and manipulating colors in a more easy way basically and after that we are going to define a parameter called speed which is zero all right so here it is setting the turtle's drawing speed basically to the fastest setting uh, this is necessary uh, when creating animations as it makes the drawing process as smooth as possible and then we are going to use a method called height turtle all right so basically this function hide the turtle cursor on the screen so we only see the drawing and not the turtle itself all right and then after this we are going to define this bg color function so basically we are setting it black here we are setting the background of the canvas to black color using this background function this will make the colors stand out more against the dark background and after that we are using this tracer function and set it to 5 so this function controls the speed at which the screen updates by setting it to 5 uh, we are reducing the number of updates to make the drawing appear faster and smoother and after this we are going to use this width function and the width we are setting this width to 2 so here we are setting the width of the pen or turtle's cursor to 2 this controls the thickness of the animation basically and after this we are going to define a variable edge and in and we are going to set this edge with 0 0.001 this variable will be used to control the color and it will increment as the loop progresses creating a gradient effect all right so mentioning the loop uh, uh, i'm going to create a loop now for i in range which is i'm setting it to 90 so guys basically we start a for loop uh, that will run 90 times uh, this loop controls how many shapes we are drawing to create the full animation and inside the for loop i am using this color function and in this color function i am going to use this color sys module that we have imported and in this i am using this dot hsv to rgb method and here i am defining its value which is h 1 and 1 so uh, in each iteration we set the color using color sys method this converts the hsv color defined by h into an rgb red green blue color h is gradually increased which changes the color over time all right and after this uh, i am using this forward function and here i am defining 100 so the turtle moves forward by 100 pixels and now i am defining the angle it will be move forward 100 pixel to left side creating an angled line to 60 degree and then again it will move forward 200 pixel but this time on right side 
creating an angle to the right side of the animation with 120 degrees. Alright, by this right function, the turtle makes a right turn to 120 degree creating the other side of the shape. Alright, and then after this we are going to create a circle, which is, which is 50, means that this command draws a circle with a radius of 50, this adds a round shape to the pattern. And after creating it, we are going to define left fu function again and this time we are moving it with 240 degree. Basically here, a uh, turtle moves with the 240 degree, turns to the left, positioning it to the next shape in the pattern. And again, we are repeating with forward. For uh, We should write in the loop, forward with 100 pixel. And then left with 60 degree. And then again forward with 100 pixels. So this sequence continues in the geometric pattern, alright, and after that we are going to increase our edge value with 0 0.02. We are increasing the edge variable's value with each iteration to create a gradient effect. Now we again use this color method and again in this color we are using this color sys module that we have imported and again we are using this hsv to rgb and again we are giving these values so basically we again updated the we, uh, we update the color again using new h values because we have incremented the h value here so we are updating this function again with the current h value and again after updating it we are again going to define this pattern to move the circle uh, to move the turtle with 100 pixels into the right basically right uh, direction with 60 degree and then again we are moving it with forward to 100 pixels to the left side with 120 degree. So uh, the turtle makes a 120 degree left turn changing its orientation basically. And then we are going to define again this circle method and now I am going to define with it minus 50. This circle commands draws a circle in opposite direction with radius 50. This will create a counter shape for more visual complexity. And after that, I'm again using this right function and now I'm moving it with 240 degree, 240 degree to right, realigning it to the next shape. All right. And then I'm using this forward method again for this shape move it to 100 pixel and then I'm using this right moving it to right in right direction with 60 degree and then again move it to 100, move 100 pixels in left direction with 2 degree only alright so uh, here when we are using this 2 degree finally the turtle makes a 2 degree left turn this slightly adjustment creates a spiral effect as the loop continues. Alright, and after this, we are going to again increment our edge value with 0 0.02. So we incremented edge again to gradually change the color over time. And after this done, we need to move out of the loop and use this done method. Alright, so basically this method tells Python that the turtle drawing is finished and keeps the window open so we can admire our work basically so let's run this program to see if it is working as we expected or not let's save and hit now we can see this beautiful scenery it is making in a slow motion animation we can see that 
yes we can see that how smooth it is we can full screen it also so basically it is the windows of the turtle that we have it is automatically generated by this turtle library and here is the effect this is the final product that we have created so guys uh, that's it uh, with just a few lines of python code we have created a beautiful colorful spiral animation this project is a great way to learn about python's turtle graphics and how to work with color in the hsv space if you enjoyed this video please do not forget to like subscribe and hit the bell icon for more coding tutorials let me know in the comments what other projects you would like to see next thanks for watching and i will see you in next one